Hi everyone, I'm thrilled to tell you all that I have an interview with the wonderful Vincent Corazza. Among many of his works, Vince is the voice actor for Zexion of the Kingdom Hearts series, and that is the theme for this interview. I know how excited many fans are going to be because of all the requests I've received to do an interview with Vince. Now sit back, relax, and enjoy! When you first started your work as a voice actor, then, was there someone you looked to as a mentor or inspiration? Uh, my first real inspiration were the voices from Scooby-Doo when I was a kid. Uh, it was my favorite cartoon, and I used to love imitating the voices on that show, and I actually got a chance to meet and work with two of my biggest influences on an episode of the new Scooby-Doo a few years ago. Um, that was Frank Welker, who plays Scooby and Freddy, and Casey Kasem, who plays Shaggy. Looking at Zexion's character, what aspect of voicing him did you find most rewarding? It's always hard to pinpoint one thing that I enjoy the most about any character that I work on, uh, but for me, it's always a blast to become a completely different person by just using my voice. I did enjoy the fact that Zexion is always very calculating and guarded. Uh, he's not your typical loud, abrasive bad guy. He's more devious and always plotting. What was your first experience in voice acting? And do you have any special memories of it? My first experience was a class called Microphone Technique that I took while studying theater acting at Ryerson University in Toronto, Canada. It was a second and third year class that really opened my eyes to the art and techniques of working in front of a microphone, and I realized that I could actually have a career in that kind of work. If you were to change something about Zexion's personality, what would it be and why? Uh, nothing really. I like that he is different from the other organization members, and he seems to be more devious and calculating. Do you have any thoughts on the Kingdom Hearts series as a whole? And if so, what are they? It's been a lot of fun being a part of it. The creative team are really great people, and I enjoy working with them. They're all incredibly dedicated to making the games as enjoyable as possible for the fans, and they put a lot of time and detail into making sure we stay true to the characters. Of all your voice acting jobs, how would you compare voicing Zexion to any of your other characters? I've enjoyed every character I've played, and it's very hard to make comparisons since they're all a part of me and my creations. But like I mentioned before, Zexion's a much more calculating personality, and that is an interesting characteristic that I enjoy portraying. What is your favorite pastime when not voice acting or acting, Vince? Uh, my favorite thing is to spend time with my wife, Jane, and I also love to surf whenever I can. As well as your favorite ways to spend your time off, you must have a favorite food and drink. What is your preference when it comes to a meal and beverage? Ha! Huh. So, uh, there are so many things I love to eat and drink. Um, okay, the first would probably be a Big Mac. <laughs> um, I also love uh, an, all Italian pastas, all pastas of all kinds. Um, I love gnocchi, lasagna. Um, my favorite dessert would be my mother's cherry cheesecake. Um... Uh, anything my wife cooks is amazing. She's an awesome cook. Uh, I love anything barbecued. Um, <laughs> and then as far as drinks go, uh, I love Scotch and Coke, Diet Coke, Scotch and Diet Coke for some reason. Um, and I love a margarita. As you mentioned about Sexion's personality, he's a very calculating and sort of devious character. Do you see any of Sexion's own personality in yours? And if so, how? You know, I don't think I really see uh, Zexion's personality in my own. Um, other than, you know, I mean, I can be calculating when it comes to, you know, what I want in my life, but not in a bad way. I don't think, you know, I don't think it's the same way as Zexion. Um, and I hope I'm not a devious character. <laughs> You've been acting both on and off screen. Is there a form that you prefer over the other? And what do you feel is the defining difference between the two? I would definitely have to say that on camera is uh, what I really love the most. Um, and the difference between the two, uh, 
you know, well, I guess with on camera, you're limited by your physical looks, your body. Um, the challenge with on camera is that um, you have to come off as believable using not just your voice, not just your emotions, but your physicality. Ev everything is so important um, because the viewer sees, sees it all. So if you're, you know, really upset, but you're not physically connected to that, it doesn't come off as believable. Whereas with voice acting, you can do anything. I mean, which I, I love too. I, I love being a voice actor. And I think both careers complement each other. There's, you know, a lot to be learned by being a voice actor um, that you can apply to being an on-camera actor and vice versa. Um, but with voice acting, one of the great things is you can be anything. Um, I can be, I can play a woman as a voice actor, probably not as well as a regular woman would play, the, you know, a, a, a woman, but you know, I can, I can play anything. I can play a kid. I can play an old man. You know, I can play a bad guy like Zexian. Um, you can be a monster, uh, so that's a lot of fun. Um, and one of the challenges with voice acting is making things sound real and really understanding the technique involved uh, when you're on a microphone. If you yourself were to be a character in the Kingdom Hearts series, would you choose to be on the hero or the villain side, and why? Uh, both sides would be fun to be on. Um... Hard to commit to one. I love playing villains. They're so much fun. Um, you get to go places with your voice usually that you don't usually get to go uh, to as a hero. Um, but there's something awesome about being a hero too. Uh, you know, those those can be fun as well. Um, I'd probably have to, if I had to narrow it down, I just, I can't do it. I can't do it. I like both sides. I love doing it all. <laughs> Since this interview is especially aimed towards your work as Vexion, would you mind saying something for the fans in his character, Vin? I hope you enjoyed this interview. If not, I might have to do something nasty. In closing, Vin, what is the best advice you could give to aspiring voice actors and actresses? Uh, my advice to any aspiring voice actor or actress would be try to find a really good class that's recommended and do your research because, um, you know, that's one of the best ways to just get somebody who knows what they're doing to help guide you. Um, the other thing I would really highly recommend is just to practice. Practice on a microphone. Try to get a microphone um, so that you can get used to hearing your own voice and used to playing around on a microphone. You know, you have to learn how to, you know, the techniques that are involved and you really learn that by getting in front of a microphone. Um, the other thing I would say is to play around as much as you can, like, you know, in on a mic and off mic, just create voices, play around with your voice, experiment and have fun, always have fun. Um, and then lastly, I would highly recommend listening to TV and radio commercials, um, you know, uh, watching animated shows, imitating what you hear li when you watch video games or play video games and you hear voices, imitate them. Try to play. See how they, you know, if they're, if it's a villain, try to act like the villain. You know, play with your voice because the more comfortable you get, the more you can do. It's really unlimited. Um, and everybody can do it. Anybody can do it. It's just really understanding your own voice and then practicing. I can't thank you enough for taking the time to do this interview with me, Vince. I really had an awesome time getting to know you more. You made the interview so much fun. I know that there are going to be a lot of very happy fans. Thank you again, Vince.